and welcome to Science Space. This is Chaitanya Somaya and today through this video we are going to study a very important cell or a battery called as nickel cadmium cell. As the name suggests it is made up of compounds of nickel and cadmium and it has a variety of applications such as these cells are used in calculators, photographic equipments and electronic watches. So watch this video carefully and if you get any doubts you can ask them in the comment section below. So students let us first of all study the construction of a nickel cadmium cell. It consists of a positive and a negative plate that is the electrodes which are the cathode and the anode. Then there are separators. These separators separate positive and the negative plates. The separators are made up of plastic porous material and then there is an electrolyte. The electrolyte is nothing but a solution of KOH that is potassium hydroxide. Then there is a solvent. The function of the solvent is to radiate heat from the cell and there is a cell container. This cell container is where the complete apparatus is set up. And then the next part is the positive plates are made up of porous plaque deposited with a layer of nickel hydroxide. This porous plaque is nothing but it is formed from a fine mesh wire screen. A fine mesh wire screen is taken which is then fused with nickel powder and then there are negative plates which are another electrodes and which are again made up of porous plate but it is then deposited with a layer of cadmium hydroxide and then the next part is porous plastic separators which are placed between the plates that is the electrodes and the last part is the electrolyte. Electrolyte is a 30% concentrated solution of potassium hydroxide mixed into distilled water and which is act as an electrolyte. Before this video, we had seen many other cells in which we had discussed about the oxidation and reduction occurring at the anode and cathode terminals of the cells. So go through those videos as a part of revision. Now let us continue with the working of nickel cadmium cell. So at anode as a part of uh, oxidation, the cadmium electrode and hydroxyl ions, OH negative ions from the electrolyte. These two will combine and it will form cadmium hydroxide that is CdOH twice and two electrons will be released in this process. So loss of electrons is called oxidation and at cathode the reduction will take place. In reduction these two electrons will be accepted by the nickel oxide present on the electrodes. The nickel oxide layer is present on the electrodes. So this nickel oxide layer and water from the electrolyte will combine with these two electrons to form nickel hydroxide and hydroxyl ions will be released. So the net cell reaction combining these two reactions at anode and cathode will be obtained as we will add left hand side to right hand side. So we will get Cd in solid form plus nickel oxide in solid form again uh, combined with water that is 2H2O will give CdOH twice that is cadmium hydroxide and nickel hydroxide from this second reaction. So this will give the combined cell reaction of this electrochemical cell. Now let us revise it once. So add anode. Anode per kya hoga? Oxidation hota anode per. What is oxidation? Loss of electrons by an electrode is called oxidation. So cadmium, yahan par cadmium hydroxyl ions ke saath combine kar raha hai. Hydroxyl ions kaha par produce honge? Into the electrolyte solution. So this hydroxyl ions will release two electrons. Ye hydroxyl ions two electrons release karenge aur form hoga cadmium hydroxide. And next nickel oxide on the cathode terminal. Cathode terminal ke upar nickel oxide ye combine karega water ke saath jo electrolyte mein present hai. And two electrons from this reaction. Is reaction se aane wale do electrons ko accept kiya jayega at the cathode. This gain of electrons is called reduction. So by gaining electrons nickel oxide will reduce to nickel hydroxide and hydroxyl ions will be formed. Or in those reactions ko milakar 
नेट सेल रिएक्शन कैसे फॉर्म होगा बाय एडिंग लेफ्ट हैंड साइड टू लेफ्ट हैंड साइड एंड राइट हैंड साइड टू राइट हैंड साइड तो इससे क्या मिलेगा कैडमियम इन सॉलिड फॉर्म प्लस निकल ऑक्साइड इन सॉलिड फॉर्म प्लस टू टाइम्स ऑफ वाटर इन लिक्विड फॉर्म और राइट right साइड में क्या मिलेगा कैडमियम हाइड्रो ऑक्साइड के साथ निकल हाइड्रो ऑक्साइड एड होगा दोनों भी सॉलिड फॉर्म में प्रेजेंट रहेंगे ऑन द इलेक्ट्रोड सो दिस वॉज ऑल अबाउट द कंस्ट्रक्शन एंड वर्किंग ऑफ अ निकल कैडमियम सेल it is a very important cell as it has various advantages as compared to dry cell first of all they are rechargeable as they can be connected to dc adapters for which the voltage can be applied to them and hence they can be recharged again and then they are also more durable than the dry cells so these are the advantages of the nickel cadmium cell Thank you for watching this video and do not forget to like share and subscribe to my channel so that you get updates on the other videos regarding this chapter